Right, guys. It's not Ray Duggan guy again. The crazy guy, you know. From England. Hey, I'm finally going to get round to doing the unboxing of the Hairy Bikers 4.3 litre active fry or oh. air fryer sorry Right. Are we still on? Right, I've only got 20 minutes. Then my camera cuts off. So, let's see what we can do. First of all, we have to get the nightmare of a security seal off. There we go. There we go, Jeff. Don't know who Joe is, but right. We open the lid and we have a handle. Oh, it's a pretty handle. And we open that one. We open that one. It's a good box. And then, which way does this go? Uh, straight in front of the camera. Oh, I can't do it. Hold on a minute. Push it back a bit. Pull it forward, back forward. Right, back up, you zoom out, maybe I'm not zoomed out, right we got the instruction book, 4 litre air fryer, honest reliable robust, that's what I said yesterday, then there, there is something on the top but I don't know till I plug it in, uh, basic instructions, cleaning, you got a, a trivet. Oh, you got a trivet for um. You've got a trivet for uh. Obviously for stand in the pan. This is what I don't like about my pressure cooker. You can do all sorts in it, but they don't provide a good enough trivet to put it in. So now I can steal. Uh, 1,400 watts uh, must be earthed oh and you have got recipes in it you got chicken nuggets you got fried squid golden chicken wings Asian spicy fries okay you've got spicy shrimp so there is what one two three four five but i won't be trying any of them <clears throat> again the dreaded polystyrene with a three pin plug um okay We've got the packet. I like the way this stuff is now easy to unpack. Normally it's a complete and utter nightmare. Right, where's the bottom? 
Where's the bump of the back? <laughs> Taking the plastic off. Oh. oh, it's worth some time to get a condom on. All right. It'd be nice. There we go. Oh, it's nice. I like it. Shiny. Shiny, shiny. Right. They aren't pre-select. It just tells you, yeah, it just tells you how long to put everything on for. Right, a tip. If you get a jacket or a zip that you've got broken, see these little black things? If you put that in your zip that snapped, twist it, yeah, twist it onto the, it might be a jacket zip, it might be a suitcase zip, it might be a bag zip, there you go, you've now got a pulley for your zip again, so don't throw them away, they're always coming handy. You've got your, you got your plastic cover is normal for British phone, uh, British phone, uh, British plugs. Right, take the, take the block five stick off the side. Keep that, might need it as the butterfly stitch, you might cut yourself while you're cooking. You need a stitch and you can put that on and hold your skin together. Nice and, sh nice and shiny look, shiny shiny. Right, pull, pull the tray out. Right, Christmas. Get through it. There we go. Yeah, nice and hard. Nice deep pan. I don't know what size chicken you get in it, but. Okay. Oh, that's to stand everything on. You stand everything on that. So you take it out, and then all your grease and your rubbish will be in the bottom. Yeah, that's awesome. Okay, it goes in one way. Okay. What was that? Bear with me a minute. You've got a... If you can see that, the element is at the top there. So you're going to have to be really, really careful of what you put in there. Otherwise it's going to burn all over the element. And I can't see this lasting very long. Because the fat, the fat's going to spit and it's going to go straight up. To me that's a fire hazard. Right, you've got up to two, 200 degree. You've got up to... ...30 minute timer. Don't. I've just broke it. Uh, I tried to force the timer backwards and it didn't work. Um, 
I think it's all right. Just don't try doing that, okay? Only the top one goes, can be changed. So you've got zero to 200 degree. So what will that be? 20, 40, 60, 80, no. Oh, well that doesn't make sense. Ten, twenty, no, twenty, forty, sixty, no, that don't make sense. So forget your zero to eighty because you'll never work out what that temperature is, because there's one, two, three, four, five marks before it gets there. Well it's five marks once you get to eighty. So it'll be 16, 32, 48, 54, uh, 5, 1, 3, 6. So it'll be 16, 32, 48, 48, 58, 64, 80. Uh, This doesn't make sense. This really doesn't make sense. You've got 85, 90, then it goes to 100. So then from 80 to 90, you've got 5, but then all of a sudden it jumps 10. Yeah, this is going to be very complicated to use. You've got 16, 32. 48, 64, 80. But then you've got 20 degrees between 80 and 100. Anyway, it doesn't matter because most of the stuff you'll be cooking will be on. It doesn't make sense. It doesn't make sense. You've got 200 degree, then you've got 160 degree. Uh, it doesn't make sense. You, 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 can, you can't possibly work out the temperature. You've got 160, then you've got 200, but then you've only got two markings in between, which is 40, so each one of the markings would be 20. Well, no, it's 1, 2, 3, 4. So if you say 170, 180, then 200. This is, it doesn't work. What well, you normally do is you go 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, 120, 160, 180, 200, 220, you know, like that. Or 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100, 110, 120, 140, 150, 160, up to 170. Oh, this is going to be a nightmare. Where's the instruction book? So there you go guys, there's the first fault I found with it. There is no... No normal way to sort out your temperature. So you've got your 200 degree. Then you'll go down to 160. So 160, 175... 190 but then um, oh, I can't think you've got 160 120 okay guys give me two numbers between 160 and 200 comment below
170, 180, 200, 170, 500, 190, yeah, it's just not going to go. There isn't a number between 160 and 200 that could be divided by 2. Because if that was 180, 200, that would make that 220, not 200. And if it was 10, so we're looking at what? What we're looking at? 160, 174, 188, 188, 198, 202. So you're looking at about 13 and a half degrees. So you're looking at 160, 170, 180, 200. 170. So if you wanted it at 170, you'd put it up just below anyway we'll make it do we'll make it work um right what does it say at the top chips 200 degrees yeah there you go 180 degree where is 180 174, 188, 173, 186, 186, 199. Yeah, so that's about 173, that would be about 186, then 200 will be 190. Yeah, you, you, you could work it out. 180 will be there, basically, or in, in the middle of them two, somewhere. We put it just below. So 160, 173, 186, that would be 199. Not going to argue. So if you want 180, you put it just below the black dot. Right, okay. 160, right, 160, 200. Uh, luckily, I think it's 180, so it's going to be about oh, 186, I suppose. Right. Roast chicken, 45 to 50 minutes, 200 degrees. Corn, 200 degrees, 15 to 20 minutes. Chicken drumsticks, like I did the other day, 200 degrees for 20-30 minutes. Chops, hunt or steaks, 180 degrees for 10 to 20 minutes. Fish, 160 degrees for 15 to 20 minutes. Bread, 180 degrees for 20 to 30 minutes. Cupcakes, 160 degrees for 20 to 30 minutes. Lobster, crab, whatever, or yeah, I suppose that's fish. Uh, no, uh, seafood, not fish. You've got fish 160, then you've got seafood 160. Oh, yeah, fish, both the same 160, 160. Uh, looks well, bacon, possibly 180 for 20 things. That 180 degrees is gonna throw me let's see what the book says anyway I'll be back because I'm running out of time